It is regarding the deployment of precinct level and PSA level anti-crime units. These are the plainclothes units that operate our traditional anti-crime. Effective immediately, we will be transitioning those units, roughly 600 people citywide, into a variety of assignments, including Detective Bureau, Neighborhood Policing, and other assignments. Why? This is 21st century policing. Intelligence, data, shot spotter, video, DNA, and building prosecutable cases. It continues to be building these cases, cases on a small number of people that unfortunately still terrorize parts of this city. However, the key difference, we must do it in a manner that builds trust between the officers and the community they serve. I started speaking about a number of reforms that have just recently been passed. Make no mistake, this is a seismic shift in the culture of how the NYPD polices this great city. It will be felt immediately throughout the five district attorney's offices. It will be felt immediately in the communities that we protect. I will take some questions. What? John? It's a it's a big move when you look at culturally how we police this city, John. And what we always struggle with, I believe, as police executives, is not cr keeping crime down. It's keeping crime down and keeping the community working with us. And I think those two things at times have been at odds. I would I would consider this in the realm of closing one of the last chapters of Stop, Question, and Frisk. I would put it as that high of a, a time. Um, this is no reflection whatsoever on the men and women of the police department that are out there doing the work. This is a policy shift coming from me personally. The men and women of the police department were doing what I and others before me asked. They have done an, an exceptional job, but again, I think it's time to move forward and change how we police in this city. Uh, we can do it with brains, we can do it with guile, we can move away from brute force. And it is, it is lost on no one, certainly not the people that live in the neighborhoods that we serve, that endure being stopped, or their children being stopped. We can do it better, we can do it smarter, and we will.